Okay, hey guys, um, let me turn the TV down a little bit. I have it on as background mode, so you might hear like buzzing. Um, okay, so I just got done with day two of Rocking Body, and as you can tell, I'm like really sweaty. I don't know, you could probably see it glistening right here. Um, that was pretty fun. Um, also, you might hear my neighbors yelling because we're get. I live in the ghetto, and so it's uh, Friday night. So they they they've been drinking most of the day. I know this because I work from home, and I I see them on the porch drinking all day. Anyways, that's a whole different story. Um, I just got done with Rock and Body Day Two. Um, today's exercise consisted of Mark Moving Groove and Party Express, and it was pretty fun. Um, like I said yesterday, there. Uh, Mark Moving Groove is um, uh, kind of, it teaches you like kind of like the basics of what you go through. I'm assuming for the rest of the workout. Um, ooh, my hair. Anyways, um, I'm still sweating. I don't have my thoughts together. Okay, so Mark Moving Groove was kind of teaching you the basics of everything that you're going to do. Um, it seems like before he adds new moves, he tells you what they are and you mark them, which means like when you mark something, it's you don't do it, you don't do it full out. You just kind of get the basics of it. So like say you're doing something and you're supposed to put your hands up, but you don't put your hands up all the way. You just go out. out. You kind of do it like half ass. You kind of you're kind of doing something half ass just so you can learn how to do it like really quick so like say hands out or like this so when you're marking it you just be like this like on the side you do it like kind of I don't know how to explain it um anyways but it seems like he marks everything out before you add this before he adds it to the sequence so it seems pretty fun um and I was really excited to do it today and I'm really excited to do it tomorrow because tomorrow's disco groove disco Anyways, um, it was really fun. Party Express is a little bit more intense. Um, I believe it's about 25 minutes long. So with Mark Moving Groove and Party Express, that was about 40 minutes of workout. Um, I don't really know what to say. Just some things that like trip me out. In uh, this new video, Party Express, there's a girl like working out in a corset. Oh, fine and dandy, I can work out in a corset. Um, I don't know if it really is a corset, but it looks like a corset with a uh, capri jogging pants and her workout shoes. So I just finished. I said this like eight times already. I just finished it. And I didn't eat dinner yet, so what my dinner is going to consist of now that I worked out. I don't know, do you ever work out and then feel guilty eating afterwards? Like, you know you're supposed because you're not supposed to eat or work out on a full stomach. So usually when I work out, I, like, when I know I'm going to work out, I eat, like, a, like, a, a bar or, like, some carrots or something. Something that I know that's going to sustain me for like the next hour or so but then afterwards when it's like your meal I always feel guilty for eating like I just worked out why am I gonna eat um afterwards like like if I eat then that defeats the purpose of working out um I always feel guilty so my dinner tonight is gonna consist of um and I'm guessing this is just gonna go for the next 30 days, my dinner is going to consist of something extremely light. Um, <clears throat> so right now I have water because I'm drinking that, so I'm rehydrating because water is important. And I'm doing protein in a... I added um, pepitas, also known as pumpkin seeds, and sunflower seeds. 
onto and well I spread peanut butter onto a whole wheat tortilla because that was always like a snack for me when I was little was peanut butter on a on, well on a tortilla but I can't eat tortilla whole wheat tortilla though a uh, corn tortilla and flour tortilla like a normal flour tortilla is in tier four of Michi's ladder that I talked about yesterday and a whole wheat tortilla is in tier two. See, I told you I try and eat in tier one and two. Um, so I spread some peanut butter on. I don't know where peanut butter is though. Whatever. Oh wait, I'll tell you right now. I have this right here. Um, peanut butter. <laughs> Um, peanut butter is in tier 4, but whatever, it is a carb and a fat. So anyways, I put, is that where it was? Do I have nuts on here? Pumpkin, or pumpkin seeds. Oh, sunflower seeds are tier two. Um, I don't see pumpkin seeds. Not salty. No, that's nuts. Anyway, um, I spread peanut butter on a whole wheat tortilla, and then I added pepitas and sunflower seeds. So pumpkin seeds and sunflower seeds on top of that. So I'm eating that right now. Mm, delicious. Um, I took my little niece's bowl. It's a toddler bowl, and I'm eating um strawberries. So. Mm. Let's see where strawberries aren't in this aisle. Strawberries, tier one, yay! Yeah. So it was really fun. Mm. I don't even know what else to say. It's you're running, this one is a lot of like running around and I don't know if it's me or sometimes I can't tell what Shanti is saying because he's like, sorry I just totally checked to see if there was something in my teeth because whatever he says kind of rhymes so I'm like, what? And it isn't until, like, he does the move that I'm like, oh, okay, now I got what he said. But, no, that's just me. Or maybe it's not me and somebody else was the same way too. Anyways, um, this one was a lot of arms. A lot of arms, but nothing, nothing too hard. Something that you need. You definitely are going to need rhythm. And if you don't have it, you need to go out and find some really quick. Because if you get off, um, if you don't have rhythm, I'm not going to say that. If you get off rhythm, you're kind of going to like mess yourself up. So, that's about it. Oh, I'm gonna finish eating dinner. And I'm gonna take a shower. Oh, and I did do my before. Sorry, I'm just hungry. Mm. I did do my before pictures yesterday, so. Maybe at the end you'll see them. Um, that's about it. 
Alright, I'm hungry, you guys. I'm gonna like chow down on this stuff. So, mm -hmm. see you guys again tomorrow. And we'll see how Disco Grief and Hardcore Abs go. Lord. Well, I did Ab Ripper X. And that is intense. So, I don't think. I think it's just hardcore abs. I don't really think it's that hardcore. I think it just says it to make it seem like it is. Because this isn't really like a hardcore exercise program. Oh. Unless we're doing more than 339 ab exercises, which is ab ripper x. Bam! Thank you, Tony Horton. Okay, bye.